Hey, what's up guys? This is Sam here with CustomPCReview.com and I'm here at LSI AIS 2012. I'm here with uh, Thomas McCarthy and he's the product mar marketing manager um, on the Synchro CS uh, line of products. So he's going to tell us a little bit about what Synchro CS is and why it's important to you guys. So take it away. Yeah, so Synchro CS is our high availability product line. Uh, basically, we leverage the Mega RAID controllers, the RAID controllers that we've used before, in order to build clustered servers out of it. And uh, what we're able to do is provide failover and shared storage at a much lower cost of what the current solutions on the market are available today. So, yeah, so, uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's much better cost uh, model for uh, small to medium sized businesses, remote offices, and it's also uh, leverages a lot of the performance benefits the Mega RAID controllers offer uh, in a direct at attached storage environment. So it's a lot simpler to deploy than uh, you know going to more of a, a SAN based model for the shared storage. So can you uh, give us a little demonstration on uh, what what you guys have with the uh, Synchro CS products? Sure. sure. Okay. So what what we have here is we've got a rack that has two servers in it. Each of them have a Synchro CS controller card and both controllers are cabled redundantly into this very inexpensive JBOT enclosure. The JBOT is outfitted with 16 serial attached SCSI drives and both servers, both controllers in each server see all of the storage within the enclosure and see it as being shared. Now what we've done in this demo is we've created two separate volumes. Each volume uh, through the Windows Server 2012 uh, cluster failover manager, we've uh, installed then on top of that Hyper-V and built two separate virtual machines, one for each volume. With this virtual machine, uh, we have a surveillance application running, which is actually, if you can see over here, the camera is actually filming us, uh, and you can see the application running. Now, just to make things a little bit more interesting, we are letting everyone here become the client. So if you wanted to, uh, you enable Wi-Fi and go out to the Synchro CS intranet. If you use your barcode scanner, uh, then you're able to pick up the website and see the application run. But what we'll do right now is, uh, while we're online here, is we'll show you how the application will fail over and you'll see that the surveillance application should continue to keep running. So very simply by clicking on move and doing li live migration and selecting having that virtual machine move from server one to server two, we can see the VM getting migrated now. They give you a percentage to give you an idea of how long it's taking. Uh, but within seconds, you'll have that entire VM move over to the other server. Now, in a more real world uh, scenario, you've got failures occurring all the time, uh, whether it be in remote offices or data centers. So the same exact operation would happen if, say, one of these uh, power supplies went down on one of the servers. The VM would shift over to the other server and continue to run. As you can see, the application is still running now. Everything's secured and running well. So. Excellent. Thank you, Thomas, for, uh, for that demonstration. And uh, is there anything you would like to add? It's, uh, yes, thank you. Uh, so Synchro CS, the main thing is it's smart, it's simple. Uh, we provide high availability at a much lower cost, continuous uptime, and it leverages the mega RAID line of data protection and performance uh, controllers. So. Excellent. And do you have any uh, any idea on availability, any uh, pricing for anyone who might be interested? Yeah, so I mean in terms of, uh, it, we're looking at Q1 of 2013. I mean this product, we've been taking it around for the last year, so we're just going through our last few test cases. Uh, Q1, following quarter, we'll get into other operating systems. Uh, in terms of pricing, you know, we're, we're still mapping a lot of that out, but we're looking to retail somewhere in the $5,000 range for a set of two controller cards with the Synchro CS firmware, and uh, it's easily deployed, basically a kit. You go out, you pop it in, and uh, get things working like that. So.
Okay. All right. Thank you, uh, thank you, Thomas, for that. And uh, we'll be back with more coverage on LSI AIS 2012. Rebooting the system, all those kind of things that just really show the performance benefits on why anyone who's a, a gamer or a, a PC enthusiast needs to upgrade to SSDs. Mm -hmm. Okay. So yeah, so it looks so. like it looks like the uh, it looks like the SSD right here is already already uh, ready to go. It it booted up and that's all it did. Um, whereas on this side, this is the traditional hard drive. You can see that it's still going, and there's a countdown time.